فعاش القلب إخلاصا وصرت تحوم كالطير تحلق في ثقافات وتنهل من روبا الخير We do things for the sake of Allah without wanting a reward from humankind Like Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in, in Surah Al-Dahr إِنَّمَا نُطْعِمُكُمْ لِوَجْهِ اللَّهِ لَا نُرِيدُ مِنْكُمْ جَزَاءً وَلَا شُكُورًا Allah says, we feed you, speaking about feeding the poor, those who are good and close to Allah, who want the best deal. They say, we are feeding you for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. From you, we don't need anything. We don't even want a statement of thanks. All we need is for Allah to accept it. So this shows us sincerity of intention. When we do a good deed, we give out a charity, we give money, we donate something, we help out somewhere. Never do it in order to get a chip on your shoulder or to be acknowledged from humankind. If they do say thank you, Jazakallah khair, they make a dua for you, it's their goodness. But don't ever request it from them to say, you know what, I did this for you one day and this is and you forgot about it. If that is the case, then did you do it for them to remember or did you do it for the sake of Allah? So you will have a deal, but it won't be as fruitful as if you had done it for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alone. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us from those whom when we do good, we would expect a reward from Allah and Allah alone. Ameen.